Hello, my name is Vincent Dufort, and I am a consultant with the Quality Improvement Organizations. I've been around a little bit of time. I actually was around with the beginning of the uh, CMS Quality Initiative, so I uh, think I know what I'm talking about a little bit in saying that sometimes we require simplification of the process, and this is what horse is aiming to do, looking at the quality reporting under the CMS Quality Initiative. So let's just briefly tell you what HORSE is doing. Under the Quality Initiative, we're supposed to be reporting certain cases and um, also reporting encounters in the ED for the outpatient cases. And to select these cases, we look, use a variation of dates, patient age, and ICD-10 diagnosis codes if we're looking for patients with AMI, chest pain, pain management, or stroke, and the E and M codes to look at cases for, that qualify for the ED throughput. The E and M codes signify that the patient was seen by medical staff in the ER. In the ED throughput, where we have sufficient cases, sufficient encounters, HORSE does a sampling. It's integrated into HORSE. And once the cases are identified with HORSE, an input file is prepared for loading into CART. Next page is going to be a little busy, but uh, bear with me. It's the uh, only basic screen that HORSE has. And on that screen, we have the hospital ID, which is your CMS certification number, something that identifies your hospital. Have the encounter dates. This gives us the date range for the abstractions. Has to be within a quarter or within a month. We don't sample partial months or partial quarters. It's either a full quarter or a full month. The raw data points to the data from your billing file, and the destination is where HORSE will put the output. This next screen shows the same opening screen with a little bit more information. The selection between inpatient and outpatient cases down here at the bottom. For us, we'll only be looking at the outpatient cases right now. And under the outpatient cases, we're interested in two areas, either the topics, what I call the topics, that's AMI, chest pain, pain management, and stroke, or the ED throughput. These are identified independently of each other because they have different criteria. The ED throughput is sampled the other ones are not. <clears throat> Once you have set these specifications, all you have to do is click on this button at the top, generate new file to run horse. So the aim of horse, just as to, to summarize what we've talked about the M of horses to find the cases of interest. We're trying to save you time. We're trying to make things easier for you. So we've encoded into horse the diagnosis codes and the E and M codes so that it will identify the cases of interest. We also have calculated the sampling strategy that CMS recommends for the sampling. And again, this is only through the ED throughput that we're applying the sampling in the case of the AMI and the chest pain and the other diagnosis specific cases, we don't have enough cases to warrant sampling. So the only thing that's being sampled is ED throughput. We capture patient demographic and encounter information and all of that is available to load into CART when you do an import of the horse output into CART. So you're simplifying your task, 
you're reducing the amount of double data entry and possibly mistakes. And Horse prepares that file for you that imports automatically, I say, or automatic magically into CART for final abstraction and ultimately the uploading of the data into the warehouse.